Happy Friday, Grizzlies. I'm McCall Wardle. And I'm Mary Quinney. Welcome back to the new school year and our first GNN News. Today we have information on our new teacher and what they're doing along with some sports highlights and updates. GNN News starts now. that our set looks different from last year. Over the summer, Capitol's KCHS TV crew received a generous gift of a new studio from Channel 7. Check out the footage brought to you by KTVB. How about this? Capitol High's broadcasting students are starting the school year with a new set that looks pretty familiar around here. You might recall the story we did back in May. Students and their teacher, Mr. Garcia, came here to our studio and hauled away our old anchor desk during our remodel. As you can tell, it's already been put to good use on the very first day of school. Way to go to the Capitol Eagles News Channel. By the way, the old viewpoint set, that was donated to River Glen Junior High, which is a Capitol feeder school. In lieu of the new set, we have received Capitol's old set and are extremely excited to start off the year by sharing all of the River Glen news with you. Last week, our cross-country Grizzlies had a time tri trial up at Capitol with fellow Eagles and Falcons. Some of the top finishers were Isaac Antonin, who finished third overall in the boys' heat, and Candace Mitchell, who finished 11th for the girls. Great job, Grizzlies! Our teachers had a busy start of the school year, and we always appreciate their hard work to get things ready for the school year. Check out this video of the opening Boise School District meeting. Know that we got a new tech teacher, computer science teacher? This teacher has an awesome workspace. Hi, this is Mr. Johns. I am the River Glen tech and computer science teacher. Just wanted to introduce myself and let you know if you're wondering or have ever wondered what that portable is outside um, near the bus lane, that is this room here. This is the 
awesome tech room. We've got a computer lab plus tool lab. And all of my tech classes are building water rockets with slight different uh, specs and requirements. And uh, we'll be having a competition to see which grade level launches the highest water rocket. Every day is a great day to be a grizzly. Hey, Johnny, I'm in Tech 7, and today we're building um, a water rocket. Hi, my name is Dylan, I'm in Tech 7, and we're building water rockets, and I had an idea. So we have one thin 20 ounce bottle, 16 ounce bottle here, with a cardboard tube and filling attached. What we're going to do is attach uh, this tube here on the bottom and have a uh, larger cone around here. That way we can pump more air into the rocket and fill it up. Okay, thank you. Uh, I am Fionn Uwu Wolfie, or Keegan as my real name, and um, I'm in Tech 7, and we are doing water rockets. Um, hello, my name is Keegan, and I'm in Tech 9. Uh, we're building, uh, in Tech 9, we're building water rockets. Launching 3, 2, 1, go! Okay, launching. Three, two, one, go. Oh, it's coming coming down faster, I think. Yep. Locked. You can let go. Launching, three, two, one, go. Whoa. That definitely won. Stop by and meet Mr. Johns and check out his awesome setup. Our football team has played Hillside this last Tuesday. Lightweight beat Hillside 22-8 in a strong first win for the season. Brody Call led the team in rushing yards and Henry Be Beatty in re reception yards. Heavyweights lost with a score of 16-6 to against the Rams. Are you interested? Are you interested in, in something meaningful and awesome? Check out our adaptive PE peer mentor program that we have right here at Riverbend. Stop by the gym and visit Miss Champion for more information. Today in history, in 1781, the French fleet arrives in Ch Chesapeake Bay to aid the American Revolution. Quote of the day, people who are crazy enough to think they can change the world are the ones who can do it. By Rob Silton. Have a great weekend, Grizzlies. Tune in next week for more GNN News.